A record 24 teams signed up for this year's Dragon Boat Regatta, held annually at Broome's Town Beach. But only one was wearing fake lashes. Fixing my eyelash, I've lost them, I'm losing an eyelash. It's a very, very <laughs> serious operation. The drags on a boat team brought together gay, lesbian and transgender folk from across WA's north. They may not have been the favourites to win the 300 metre sprint, but there was a clear determination to have a good time. I don't know how we'll go against some of the really professional rowers, but you know, we're going to give it our all and all I can say is it will be entertaining. And there was plenty of crowd support. They look fantastic. Yeah. They've gone to a lot of trouble with their outfits. In their first race, the team got off to a great start, but things soon got shaky. Oh, the boat kind of tipped a little bit, and I just happened to be too far out and just fell in. And less than a minute later, the entire team went overboard. Ladies, what just happened? Uh, we, we took a dive. <laughs> giving them a chance, giving them you know, a chance. Trying to tell drags to go straight, just ain't happening. <laughs> We got excited because we were catching up. <laughs> and then we got too excited and rode too hard and then all of a sudden we were, we were in the drink. The Broome Pride group formed earlier this year and already has more than 50 members. Some travel hundreds of kilometres from towns across the Kimberley to attend their regular get-togethers. It is it's very important for the um, gay community, even if it's just a social group, that there's still that support of like-minded people. Drags on a boat did not make the finals, but they did succeed in having a fabulous time. Hats off to a lot of the guys that were game enough to come out today and pop a frock on just to promote that inclusion and it's just part of um, what Kimberley and Broome's all about. It's just such a friendly, inclusive community. They'll soon be in training for next year's race. Erin Park, ABC News, Broome. Rowing a dragon boat can be hard enough work at the best of times. But ever tried doing it in high heels and a feather boa? That's coming up later in the program. Rowing a dragon boat can be hard enough work at the best of times. But ever tried doing it in high heels and a feather boa? That's coming up later in the program.